Okay, welcome. I'm going to teach you how to download textures onto some of the default airplanes for Flight Simulator X. Okay, now what we are first going to do is open Internet Explorer or Firefox or whatever. Okay, now we are going to go to simviation.com. You can get all your textures uh, from anywhere. You could go on Google and search them, or you can go to AvSim, other places, but I like Simviation. So, what we're going to do is it's probably going to be in Civil Jets, um, or there will be military or uh, props, which is propeller, but I'm not going to go through all those. Um, so, I'm going to search. And you'll get a Gamefly pop-up. That's practically every time. It's not a virus or anything. So, and okay, now I'm going to type in Flight Sim X China Airlines 747. Okay, now I didn't type in texture on that one on accident, but. I already know this is the page, but you have to, when you enter in uh, what you want to download, you have to put textures, and a lot of these, uh, in the Civil Jets, when they when we first started, like when Flight Simex first got out, people started making textures first, so, um, I was looking for the China Airlines 747 here, here it is, China Airlines textures only, for default 747-400 right there then you click on it and click download this file now now you click save and you can re and then you can Rename it, and I'll rename it 747 China Airlines. Save, and it will load. And then this texture China will come up. Then uh, you can open it, and this actually does have a thumbnail. Some of them don't, so you go onto Google and type in China Airlines 747 save it to the desktop and then rename it to thumbnail and drag it into this texture folder and you can do that with any airplane it just has to be the texture folder now usually don't read these readme files but with textures you always have to that's an always because you have to get this right here this copying uh... it's a little kind of variation thing you'll see it it's practically the only thing that you'll know uh... for the first time you do this read it the instructions and it should tell you. Okay, so okay. Now we are going to copy all these and click Extract to Desktop and click OK. Okay, now you see this texture, the README, and the file ID. The file ID you don't really need, so we can re throw that recycle bin. Now you're going to go to your computer. Uh, I've run Vista. Uh, this is the same with XP. But uh, you go to computer. Some of it's on your uh, desktop, and you can just click it. Go to local disk. Program files. Microsoft games. Microsoft Flight Simulator X. Uh, sim objects airplanes and then you'll come up to all the ones that you should have downloaded and such uh, the default Boeing 747 is this one B747 under mark 400 so we're going to open it first thing you could do get the rid of the texture China you just drag the whole texture thing in there continue Okay, now once that's completed, you need to get the aircraft CFG file. Take it with Vista users, you drag it to the desktop because on XP you should just be able to edit it f when you click on it. Okay, now you are going to take this README file and copy what uh, some of them it'll tell you what to copy, some of it won't. 
but uh, you could probably can't really see it very good on the YouTube video, but it's practically just this thing, if you could kind of tell. You should know it has Flight Sim X, uh, Point X, and sort of like a parentheses or whatever those are called. Go to Aircraft. Now, it's the first thing here. You'll see it already. If you don't know what it is, look, click on your Aircraft CFG. It's in every airplane. And the first thing will be there is the the thing you're supposed to copy and I have a lot of 747 things so my last one is 17 right here and then you'll see general so press a few space bars uh, top general and then just paste it now the last one like I said was 17 so where it says in this like parentheses the first thing it says flight sim uh, dot x some of it will say play it replace number here you know you just erase the next the X, so it's flight sim dot, and then we're going to replace it with 18 because it's the last first one is 17. The first one in the line should always be zero, and then it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You get the point. Then go to file, save, not save as, exit out, and always, always make sure to drag the aircraft CFG back into the airplane folder, or else your airplane will not be on there. Okay, now when you open your select aircraft, you should come up to, I don't know how many airplanes you've downloaded, some of the defaults, and then you just go to the regular 747s, uh, these are the or original ones, make sure to click show all variations down at the bottom right here, and it'll show all the textures, if you don't click that you won't see your texture, and you'll start freaking out, here is the 747 China Airlines. And then I'm just going to click details so it'll uh, show me the airplane faster. And here is my airplane. It's showing the lights and all that uh, because right now it is nighttime. And now you've just downloaded your first texture. And if you want any other tutorials on anything, including Flight Simulator X, please subscribe today and comment or message me. And I will make a video. Thanks, and this is TCCO94. You can't touch this. You can't touch this. You can't touch this. Oh.